Korea's constitutional court has declined President Park Geun-hye's request to delay the final hearing on her impeachment trial. There still may be a way for her to buy more time, though. For more on that, as well as other rapid relevant developments, we turn to our Kim ji -yeon. During the 15th hearing in the impeachment trial of President Park Geun-hye, the Constitutional Court said it is sticking to its original plan to hold a final hearing on Friday, and it told the president's lawyers to tell the court by Wednesday if the president will testify. The court said it will not delay the final hearing or hear the president's testimony at a later date if the lawyers fail to notify the court. The court also said the president has to answer questions from both legal teams if she does appear. Moving the possibility that the president could swoop in just for the closing argument. We respect the court's decision to ensure a speedy trial and hope the court concludes the last hearing on this Friday as planned. We will consult with President Park, but I personally think a court appearance will undermine the nation's dignity. The court also refused to admit into evidence most of the audio files of conversations between Choi Soon Shi's associate Ko Young Tae and his colleagues, saying they were not critical in defining the nature of the relationship between Choi and President Park. Only 29 of the audio files were admitted into evidence during previous hearings, and they will not be played during the hearings for those in the gallery to hear. During the morning session, former presidential administrator officer Pang Gi Sun testified that the issue of Samsung Group's succession plan was included in the reference material for President Park's one-on-one with heir apparent Lee Jae-yong in July 2015. Pang said there was no similar reference material for former President Lee Myung-bak when he met with the heads of conglomerates during his term. The court canceled and declined to reschedule the court appearance of former presidential chief of staff Kim gi chun after he told the court he couldn't testify citing health issues. The woman at the heart of the scandal, Choi soon shi is scheduled to testify for the second time on Thursday. Kim ji Arirang News.